Welcome to Big Bay, Cape Town, South Africa. We're only three days into the waiting period of the Red Bull King of the Air, and it is firing. The forecast is for 25 to 35 knots southeast release today. We've got a three to four meter swell running. It's sunny, it's absolutely perfect. The 24 riders are chomping at the bit to get out there and show their stuff. They've invited, you know, 24 of the best riders doing this, all from all over the world. So, you know, anyone, anyone can take it. We're pushing ourselves and seeing what humans can achieve on these devices. So, I think we can do a lot today if uh, it picks up and we're going to blow some minds. criteria is basically we're looking for big air and uh, so it's 70 percent height and then there's a 20 percent technical difficulty that's being judged we're going to really look for the guys that are just sending their kite and flying through the air i had a few really heavy crashes early on had like definitely like hit my head ripped out of my binding felt a little bit rattled but just decided to come back and had some, some thought on it. I was pretty happy with that. It was fun. The risk in every trick you see like it's growing step by step and you know guys are pushing it and you know that's what's making it interesting and you know that's the scores a lot as well. Just going all out and that's what this event is all about. This is my uh, my element, you know. If I'm out there, I don't think about anything and just do what feels right, you know. Whatever comes to my thought, I will hit it hard and uh, pull it a few biggies. We're uh, coming down to the final with four riders left. It's Nick Jacobson from Denmark. We've got uh, Sam Light from the UK. We've got the world champion, Yuri Zone from Holland. Then Hawaiian kid Jesse Richmond, he is floating around so huge, man. Everybody's loving it and wowing it. That was some of the hardest, best kiteboarding I've ever had to do in my life, and the whole event, everything was spot on. I'm so overwhelmed with joy to come out on top. I don't even know what to say. This has always been my favorite, the biggest, the best event in kiteboarding, and today was a, a day to go down in history for sure.